Hi, I'm Rich Canfield with Ultra Bond, and this video is on our new Crackmaster tool called the Wonder Bar. And we're calling it the Wonder Bar because this one bar makes these five tools. And what that means for you is, is you can have all the tools you need to do a perfect repair at less cost to you. Two of these bars assembled in the middle with a connector bolt. Uh, this tool is called the classic bridge structure. And this is used for repairing stone breaks and then is also used to straddle down a long crack. Now this tool splits apart and makes these two tools. This is a crack opener which goes on the inside of the windshield when you're doing a long crack to pry it open. And this is called a long crack repair structure. This tool slides along the crack and injects the uh, resin in. When you split it apart and you take a three inch suction cup and place it on here, you now have a stone damage tool, a single bar stone damage tool, and a star leg flexor. A star leg flexor is uh, used to flex the leg of a star break or, st or a stone break which has a leg that is being stubborn and won't fill. This happens often and the normal way to do it would be to take a metal probe and, or a screwdriver and press on it and hold it and hold it until your thumb hurt you would let go and it wouldn't be totally filled and then you'd have to do it again. Well the star leg flexor you're just going to place this on, on the leg, push the cup down and then turn your bolt until the leg flexes and then just wait for it to fill so you don't have to manually do it anymore. And you also notice that the point of the star leg flexor is pointed. And this also replaces a tool that is normally used called the probe. And you would normally probe the impact point of a stone break. So now you don't have to have a probe to do that either. It's right on your tool. Okay, now how do you put these tools together? Well, there's just nuts and bolts. This is our classic Crackmaster bridge. And this is two wonder bars. And the way you assemble this is there's a, a bolt on our website called the connector bolt, which you use to connect two of them together. You have the uh, nut on one side and the half inch screw on the other side. And you simply twist that together. And this gives you the Crackmaster bridge structure. Now how you turn the wonder bar into a crack opener is by taking two of the soft two inch cups and placing them in the hole at the end. And then you will see on our website what's called a crack opener bolt. And this is a nut and the one and a quarter or one and a half bolt. Now it's important that the, uh, the grip of the nut, the fat end of it, is on the bottom. And this, this is a tight fit that squeezes into that hole. And it's important that that fat end is on the bottom because if it's on the top and as soon as it hits the glass, it's gonna come out like that. But it stays in there and gives you the pressure as soon as that hits the glass. Okay, so it's just important to make sure the fat part of the nut is on the bottom. And this is our long crack slider. This tool is used to slide along the crack uh, and inject the resin. And the way you assemble this tool is you have a pressure bolt right here in the middle. And then on the back side here, on the back side, there is two stabilizing bolts. Okay, these are uh, one in, these are three quarter inches long with a nut. So you can adjust the, uh, the level and the pressure. And the advantages of this is that it sets the pressure at a low so that you don't push the crack closed. And it stabilizes the tool. These two on the back. And then this is a uh, two inch soft suction cup. that you 
take the soft suction cup with the uh, spacer nut on there, place it in the middle, and then screw that on. And of course then your injector. And now you have a long crack slider. Now this is the other tool that the Wonder Bar makes called the Star Lake Flexor. And this one, the way you assemble this one is with a two inch stiff suction cup. Okay, a stiff suction cup because a stiff cup is going to give you more pressure and you're going to use a little more pressure on this tool to flex open the leg. Now the bolt for this is called the star flexor bolt. This is a bolt that has two nuts on it. Okay, and this is to hold it into the injector hole. This is the injector hole. So you take the star flexor nut, place it in there, and again take the the grip part of the nut to the bottom and you place it in that hole and then that is your bolt for increasing and decreasing the pressure for the star leg flexor. Now the other tool that the Wonder Bar makes is a single bar chip repair tool. Now there are two ways to make a chip repair tool. One is to use this three inch flat cup which you attach in the middle with the nuts and bolt and a pressure bolt in the back. You can also use this tool uh, to do chip repair single bar by using the two inch stiff suction cup. So depending on how much pressure you want, this would be a high pressure stone chip repool, uh, repair tool. And if you put the uh, two inch stiff suction cup on here, you have a lower pressure chip repair tool. Okay, so that is how our Wonder Bar makes all these tools, and those are hopefully the, uh, you understand the nuts and bolts that you put them together with. Changing the suction cup changes the tool. Uh, we have three of them. There is a two inch soft, a two inch stiff, and a three inch flat, okay? So the three inch flat is for high pressure chip repair. The uh, two inch stiff is for the star flexor and for using a, a lower pressure single bar chip repair tool. The two inch soft cups go on the bridge, the crack opener, and the long crack slider. That's the basics of our Wonder Bar tool. Okay, if you are already in, our, in the business and using Ultrabond, or you're getting into the business and you're watching our training videos, these tools, uh, new tools, mechanically, they work the same as our old tools do. Just so that you know, this long crack slider is the older version that you'll see on our training videos, the live ones, and this is the new version. And you can see they're very similar. And they work the same. They basically will slide down the crack and they are stabilized by bolts in the back. And mechanically, there is no extra training for it. Uh, they work the same. But uh, this replaces this tool. The Wonder Bar replaces this crack opener. Now, as you can see, they are uh, spaced the same. Suction cups are the same. This bolt is a little narrower, which we found is opening up the crack more, uh, wider with less pressure. So there's less chance of the uh, crack going through the bullseye at the point. So this Wonder Bar replaces this tool. And this bridge, Crackmaster bridge, replaces this bridge. And you can see it's quite a bit bigger. And uh, we found the advantages of going bigger was it uh, actually gave better compression on the stone brakes. And it was much easier to use this to straddle down a crack. So this tool is replaced by that one. And this star leg flexor replaces this tool. So uh, five of our tools were replaced 
by what we're calling the Wonder Bar.